Northwest Conference action. Crestview coming into Columbus Grove as the lone unbeaten team in the Northwest Conference. Bulldog coach Andy Schaefer, though, coaching with a heavy heart as his father, Steve, passed away Monday morning at 6.15 after a long battle with cancer. 22 minutes after he passed away, the verse of the day from James 1.10 popped up on Andy's mom's cell phone, and here's what it read. Blessed is the man who is patient under trial and stands up under temptation, for when he has stood the test and been approved, he'll receive the victor's crown of life, which God has promised to those who love him. Steve Schaefer loved Jesus, and he has found his home in heaven. Grow fans excited? Down one point to Crestview in that second quarter. Knights with the ball. But Blake Reynolds, the freshman, look at this takeaway. What a job, not just a quarterback, a huge interception. Growth can't get the drive going, though. Offensively, Wade Sheets meets the runner at the line. Nice tackle. Then third down and long. Tyler Gibson spins and wins a sack here. Dogs force the punt. Short field for the Knights. Gibson plugging away. Gets four tough yards here. Then on fourth and six, Crestview's going for it. Klein does what Klein does. Dances his way into the end zone. 26 yard touchdown. 20 to 13, Crestview in front. Dogs trying to score before the half. Reynolds complete to Trevor Taylor. Beautiful toss by the freshman. A great catch. First down at the 47. Then trouble strikes for the home team. Sheets picks it off. Two way player for Crestview. Showing off the defense. Nice return all the way to the 20 of Columbus Grove. They're in business, just a couple minutes left in the half. Klein trying to run that two minute drill, 11 yard out to Grant Schlagbaum. First down at the nine, but then Enoch Jones in the backfield. What a slam, that could be a Layfield welding top five play. Final play of the half, knocking on the door. Klein throws it to the end zone, but Taylor is there to knock it away again. 20 to 13 Crestview at the half. Knights score two touchdowns in that second half, and they go away with a win. 5-0 as they take it 36-13. Drew Klein with two passing touchdowns to go, along with two rushing touchdowns on the Knights.